coming to you live from the director's chair here in Franklin, New York. And we have the second annual brother versus brother bro fight. Johnny, how are you feeling walking in and what's your coach doing to help you get prepared for the game? Hi. How do you feel you're going to do today? How about yourself? How do you feel you're going to fare today against your opponent? training for about six months now. And, uh, you know, I've got the cap. <laughs> so what do you think? It's been like three months training or? Probably like 12. I'm going to tell you he's sticking to a knot. Stop training. So what do you, what do you think, uh, uh, you know, your biggest strengths coming into the competition? I know we can't share weaknesses because we don't want your uh, opponent to take it easy. I mean, I can show you. Speed is definitely the key here. I I I, 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 uh, I see where you're going with that. I'm picking up what you're throwing down. So you're having uh, some hydration, and the referee over there. He uh, he can't be witnessing this because it'll be a howl fest, and then. No. Look at his hand break. Ah ah ah! Oh, to the rescue! Now you're gonna have to go inside the cabin so you don't throw your either opponent off. All right, we're about ready to start, so let's get ready. All right, you guys ready for round one? All right, fellas. You got Jay Honey, right? In this corner. In this corner, you have T Swoo, 23. All right. Ready, set. Let's get ready to rumble! Round one, fight! This is a uh, pretty, pretty, oh, whoa, 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 We're trying not to have the big guy fall down. We're only 15 seconds in. We got, uh, oh, that's going for the fake. Oh, what? oh, oh! Almost over the table. These guys got to realize where they are at all times. Oh, oh, John was going for that swing. You know he's got longer arms than his opponent, Tom. Oh. Let's get a little too close over here. Woo! Two minutes in. I mean, two minutes left. On round one, back away from the picnic bench. Less than two minutes to go. These guys wanted three minute rounds and then they got it. Let's see how much, whoo, let's see how much John can back, back up his shit talking on PS. Oh, here we go, one minute 40. Oh, beware of the bench. Be, I mean, beware. Because it was going to be a bench. One will be pressing the other one. Minute 22 to go. They're looking visibly tired. But they're both still standing so far. Oh. You start to see the energy shriveling from each opponent. I think uh, they might need to go for some more pain medication. A minute left. Less than a minute to go. What do we have here? Are we have a little tired tired after it is, after all, it is 83 degrees and humid as fuck today. As you can see, John's shorts are becoming see-through. 40 seconds left. Thirty 
seconds left. You can hear Otis in the background wanting to come out and stop this shit. 23. 20 seconds left. 15 seconds left. Oh, we're almost there. Fellas, we're almost there. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Pause! Now we got 3 minutes. Rest. How are you feeling after round one? Unconditioned. How unconditioned would you say? Uh, Use a beer to hydrate. <laughs> Brought to you by PBR. <laughs> Wait, I see Bud Light on the table there. Oh, your your power drink that you're holding in your hand is Pabst Blue Ribbon. The drink of champions. John, what is your drink of choice to hydrate? Oh, that's right, water. Good old motherfucking H2O. How many rounds do you guys want to go after how you're feeling right now? Two more after this. Should be good. You got two minutes left more rest. So, uh, I don't see you looking for the makers for a little pain oh we're going to h2o too oh no you got john looking good feeling good you guys need to do this every day imagine i don't know about feeling good but i'm looking good yo <laughs> <laughs> he's got a message for the ladies what's what's that yeah, message i'm a sexy motherfucker <laughs> A minute and a half? Does it feel like the shortest three minutes of your life, fellas? How much time ago? You got a minute 18. This is the second annual brother boxing bout. We had one last year at Jones Beach. I believe it was Robert Moses, wasn't it? It was Jones. It was at Jones. This year we've taken the venue upstate in an effort to give you variety. We'd like to be at a different location every year. Why is it raining? Because it's got... I got 45 seconds. It says when the timer ends. 35 seconds to go. Let's see what these punks are made out of for the last two rounds. It's definitely gonna hurt tomorrow. Think so? 20 seconds to action time. 15, 12, 10, 11, 10. I can't count today. You would think I'm on PBR. Not yet. It's White Claw. All right. Ding, ding, ding. Yep. Set the timer. You guys are uh, ready to go? Yeah, All right. Ready for round two on the brother versus brother box boxing match here in Franklin, New York. Good sportsmanship. Let's go! Oh, John's going in for the kill. Oh! Down went the big man. Tom's feeling good about himself. John picked him up self up quickly, which was really good to see. You can hear Otis in the background thinking things have stopped, so he is simmered down with his barking. I'm sure we're going to pick it up again soon. The winner of this bout claims bragging rights for the next year. And this can be determined by viewers coming in on YouTube and voting for their person of choice. Ooh, that's going to leave a mark. Two minutes left. 
Walk away from that bench. We don't need you dropping the elixir there that's helping these guys hydrate and stay focused. Minute 45. Dance. Dance. What happened to those dancing feet? Oh. Those are dancing gloves. Minute 30 to go. They were going all hot and heavy in round one. Seems to have... Oh, what's the bench? Bench, bench, bench! Minute 15 to go. Way out of bounds. One minute left. Officially a minute left now. Keep, keep plugging in. You got a minute to go. I'm very glad you guys don't impale each other on that beer pong bench over there in the back. Walmart signature. 45 seconds! Watch the bench, kid. Move forward, move forward. Thirty seconds to go. You gotta get your last licks in on round two before the bell. Twenty seconds. Oh. Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And that, my friends, is the conclusion of round two. How do you feel, Tom? How do you feel wow. right now? I don't know. I thought I would. How, so is the uh, pain medication helping you out? Gotta stay hydrated. High quality H2O. Johnny, how are you feeling? Well, maybe you should move that since you guys almost smashed it. What would you say, John? The audience could not hear your commentary after the conclusion of round. I think the sand on last match messed up our, uh, our cardio. It's harder to fight in sand. It's harder to fight in sand. It's easier to do it in the grass. What do you feel, Tom? I concur. It makes sense. How much time we got left? You got two minutes. Trying to avoid the damn timer. John, are you aware you got a muddy, a muddy back? Oh, yeah, I fell, so. How do you feel so far, young man? Sweaty. Do you feel like you Salty. should be training a little bit more? Yeah, the training of fucking lifting marshmallows into my mouth for the fat past few days. Few days? Really, really helped out with the body shots, give a little extra cushion. You know? Okay, so that's uh, that's your your advantage is having a little cushion for the pushing. When your brother pushes so, like, in his glove know, into your stomach. Same thing with gladiators. Gladiators had a little stomach. You know, make sure when, when they get cut, they're still good. They don't hit no vital organs. So if you ask me, I'm basically a gladiator in this situation. Okay, makes sense. Ugh. So Leslie is going to go get, while I'm on intermission, my white claw. Look at that muddy, babbling brook in the background. All right, fellas, you getting ready? One minute left, less than a minute.
I think we got the boys over here meditating. Is John getting any more water? Yeah, that would be. Uh, it's a pretty good opening. Yeah. We would have that as your uh, the highlight reel. Yes, the next the next day after. Let's see if we could do a, like a highlight reel. All right, fellas, you getting ready? All right, this is round three, final three. We hope that these fellas achieve everything and anything that they're looking for. Okay, ready? Set. Round three, begin. You could tell both of them are starting to get tired. They're starting to feel the effects of the first two rounds where they was fought with such great intensity on both sides. Should be really happy with their attempt here. On uh, night five of the camping trip, where we were playing movies, drinking, and beer pong, going for a couple laps in the swimming pool, get something to eat, drink more beer, watch movies, repeat, rinse, repeat. Yes, this is what we do. We were training, training for this moment. Finally here. I'm very proud of them for both showing up and uh, not quitting. And then we got two minutes and five seconds left in round three. You could tell the hits are coming. Slow. Oh, just when I spoke too soon. You got fast feet over there. Fast feet, Tommy. Minute 45 to go. It's the longest motherfucking minute and 45 ever in the history of bro versus bro boxing match. We're just hoping that John does not fall on that last lounge chair and fold that and add to the bone pile. A minute 30 to go. Whoa! Getting a little too close to the referee chair here. I, don't, I would have to be the sportswoman that I am and continue filming from the ground. Minute 15 left. Yeah, and then they would break this brand new fucking chair. That would piss mama off, but... Coming up on the last minute. One minute to go. You guys are down to the wire. Get your last hits in while you can, so that way you can talk shit the next, the rest of the year before you meet up again. 45 seconds. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the conclusion of the second annual Bro vs. Bro boxing match. We got two tired, sweaty motherfuckers. They're probably going to want to go muddy up. 30 seconds left. They're going to want to go muddy up the pool or take a swan dive into that muddy-ass river behind them. Oh! 20 seconds to go! Give it all you got! Give it all you got! Yeah! 15 seconds to go! <laughs> 10 seconds! Get it all in! 5 seconds! Please don't break the... 4, 3, 2, 1! Round 3! Stops. All right. Now that the sportsmen, the two athletes, are concluded this three round. Johnny, how are you feeling? God damn. All right. Boxing. This is what Joe Rogan usually does at the end of the boxing round, right? All right. Let's see the sportsmanship here. Nah, I don't want to get up. Man. All right. How do you feel? No, that was for, that was the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! <Ew. laughs> hey, can we hand back the microphone? All right.
How do you feel about how you did in this performance? Um, oh, I feel good. I feel, yeah, I feel refreshed. You feel refreshed from that splash of goodness, or? You feel alive, you know? You think you should There's be doing this like, more often? I got the shit in my eye. There's nothing like having another angry man, sweaty, desperate, like a corner animal. Gay? Charging at you with his hard cock and, I mean, with his gloves in hand. <laughs> it's, a, it's a feeling you never forget, you know? It's like whenever you, whenever you like feel the air in the room, you're like, all right, something's about to fucking go down. Yeah. It's, it's such a unique feeling. You wouldn't, you, it's hard to, you can't even describe it to someone who's never been in it. The only way really is just to, you know, get into it. That's, that's how we do it here. So what are you going to do? You get the fuck into it. So what are you going to do next year to prepare for year three? Probably the same thing I did this year. Marshmallows, definitely. This is a big, big part of the game plan. Definitely worked for this uh, this time. Just hoping it helps for this time or next time. Oh, oh and in, in the other uh, Tommy Tom, on? what Wait. would you say was your highest moment here? What round do you feel like you were most effective? I like that I still had energy in the third round, dancing around a little bit, you know. Um, all in all, though, I think we had a good time. Uh, I definitely uh, secured the win, at least by the second round. So we're going to have the audience of YouTube vote who won that. Yeah. In order so, to make this fair. Hopefully uh, that $100 goes to, to T. Swizzy here. Jay Honey. Better luck next time, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> well... This wraps up the brother versus brother boxing match. This is your host, Leslie M. Jasper, author of the book Construction Tales and host of the Verbally Disastrous Podcast that can be heard on over 20 platforms and YouTube, of course, on the Verbally Disastrous channel. This is Leslie signing out. Peace out, Cub Scout. Time to hydrate and get some painkiller. Tom, what's your pre-workout oh. here? Oh, I didn't know it was being recorded. Um, this is just for aesthetic reasons. Oh, you mean it doesn't help you? Pain management? Pain management, that makes sense. We know he's too young to use that type of pain management. We'll have to get him some Motrin. How do you feel now, champ? No pain. Ready to go. <laughs> nah, we're good. Reduce uh, swelling tendencies. Like this guy's got his swelling tendencies. All right, you are ready? John's like, uh, but life's on the line here. You ready there, champ? Is the timer's on. Uh, hold on. All right, we know the rules, clean fight. Let's not try to you do anything rash, do any bum moves to each other. No. We agree? Agreed. Agreed? Agreed? Yeah. All right, hold on. Now we're gonna, we're gonna come back and then it, we're gonna ring the bell. Sit down, relax for a minute.
Try not to break that chair too. See that bone pile of chairs over there? Yeah, the bone pile. They gotta go to the garbage. Anyhow, in this serene background, we have a fight coming up just shortly. Stay tuned. Next commercial coming.